So let's say I'm in a situation where I want to use an indicator on TradingView, such as the HARSI, and turn that into a strategy. Well, I can do that. So I've added the indicator to the chart. I've confirmed that they are alerts available for this indicator by going to the alerts panel, click on an HARSI and seeing that there's alerts available for it. And I'm going to go ahead and I want to say that when the HA, the uh, high can actually bar the low crosses the low and the high crosses the high. That's when I wanted to enter a long or enter a short. So I'm going to go ahead here and for the HA RSI uh, low, I'm going to connect that to crossing, uh, crossing down, and I want the value to be minus 30. I'm going to make sure that my message here is the payload that I'm expecting uh, traders supposed to respond to. So I'm sending the ticker and the action. I'm going to make sure that my webhook URL is properly populated. And then I'll create it. I'll also do the other side where I'm creating the alert. HARSI, the high, crossing above, the value 30, in order to create a cell. I can see that my alerts are properly created here. And we'll wait for the signal to cross. As I'm looking at the chart over here, I can see that there are markers at the top of the 30 and then the negative 30 uh, that TradingView puts when you create any type of alert on the chart. And you have that, you have that set in active. So I know that my strategy is set up correctly. Here the alert fires, a buy order is sent. And I could see through my webhook that the information has been received. And if I go to my broker, I can see that the position has been opened. And now if this will run buying and selling, buying and selling through the range until I stop it or set some other condition for it to end. And that's how you can turn an indicator into a strategy on Trader's Post.